several news sites report that there has been a nuclear explosion in Yemen. It is about a neutron bomb, a hydrogen bomb that which was designed so that a large part of the energy of the explosion is released in the form of neutron radiation. Well, the amount of radioactivity that is released is small. What are neutrons? Neutrons are high-speed nuclear particles that have an exceptional ability to penetrate other materials. Neutrons are the only one that can make objects radioactive. This process, called neutron activation, produces many of the radioactive sources that are used in medical, academic and industrial applications, including oil exploration. Because of their exceptional ability to penetrate other materials, neutrons can travel great distances in air and require very thick hydrogen containing materials such as concrete or water to block them. The intense pulse of high energy neutrons generated by a neutron bomb are the principal killing mechanism, not the fallout, heat or blast. What are the dangers of neutrons? The thermal pulse would cause third degree burns to unprotected skin out to approximately 500 meters. However, in the Arab and Russian media reported that the nuclear attack will be carried out by Israel. Earlier this month, two F-16s were shot down over Yemen. When the two wreckage was examined, it appeared to be that the type of airplane were never delivered to an Arab country. The only buyer of the type plane in the region is Israel, reported a US military magazine. One of the F-16 was shot down by a Russian PAK missile system. Yemen has many modern Russian weapons, including MiG-29s and advanced air defense systems. From a photographic analysis of the downed F-16 in Yemen shows that it's probably going to be one of the 15 American F-16A aircraft by the Clinton administration that has been given to Israel or a former NATO aircraft of Italy or Portugal. The only other possibility is that they are made in secret by the US directly. The airstrikes on Yemen have led to a worldwide storm of protest. US President Barack Obama promised the rich Arab oil states to support earlier this month against external attacks. He will, if necessary, use the army force to defend the country. How do you think about the use of neutrons? I want to read your thoughts in the comment section. For more information read the full article, including video of the blast. Link is provided below. Do not forget to subscribe so you never miss the alternative news. I would appreciate a lot if you share this video. I'm Heathcliff. Your host, AllianceGroundNews.com